Hey guys, welcome to another episode in a deep playthrough of PTR4. We are doing the second championship in the master um, level events. Um, in the Ferrari Enzo and we were doing a cone challenge and I thought that I got the target time. So I passed the finish line, but then it said I was second. So maybe I hit a cone or something. I have to rewatch that. Anyways, uh, I had to stop the episode short, restart the emulator before it auto saves in order to be able to try again. Because normally after you finish, you uh, are not, you cannot uh, retry anymore. So uh, the only way to do that is to just brute force uh, stop the uh, emulator and then restart it before it auto saves. And then you continue where you left off, where you were, which is that cone sprint. So here we go. It's a pretty fun one, but uh, it's weird that I didn't get it. Well, I was pretty certain I got it. Ah, wait, maybe my time was 3.35. I don't know, but the, th the weird thing is that my split times, I think, were continuously above the competition. Like, it was not that I had a gap in to somebody in front. But maybe that split times of the competition, maybe that competitor itself was not that fast. I really have to pay attention to the um, to the actual timer just in the top left corner of the screen. So maybe I, yeah, because I do remember there was quite a big difference between mid thirties and something high twenties. And now I see that the Target time is high 20, so maybe my time of the in the ending of the previous episode was mid 30s, and I thought it was the other way around. I thought incorrectly that the target time was mid 30s and my time was low uh, high 20s. <coughs> if that makes any sense, but we will just see. If the target time is high 20s and uh, my previous attempt was indeed mid 30s, then I have to do a lot better. <laughs> Let's at least try to get the first corner right.
fucking hard. Oh. I don't really like this. 
drifting. Yeah, I guess we have to make do. Thank you.